Hello everyone, I just wanted to um, kind of do a review on DHI, but also this is actually my first fragrance that I um, that I got into about three and a half months ago, um, watching Street Sense and watching some things on YouTube, and uh, Mark, you know, uh, Robes 08 and all that, you guys taught me a lot about uh, a lot of the fragrances, but this is actually my first one, this is my first review, so go easy on me, but I just wanted to basically, um, you know, I was an Aka de Gio man for... <laughs> years that's all I ever wore you know I never really knew about the winter fragrances and the summer and I mean it's just amazing all the all the cool things um, you know all the, the the scents that are out there and everything and I'm really into Creed now and and uh, this has always been for the last couple of months so I've, I've had this and it's really been one of my favorites too but uh, this is Dior Homme Intense I wanted to uh, here's the actual box that it comes in right there then you'll find your um, you'll find all your uh, Trying to get focused. This one is one U O two, so that's your batch number. Which this one is from 2011, which is actually July of 11. Now you guys be the the judge of everything. You guys kind of know when the new batches came out and everything. But I think September of 11, that's what I was looking at on a couple of the other reviews, was the actual new reformulation. Um, so this still has that kind of potent. Um, you know, it's kind of the potent juice, I think, because uh, I know April and uh, and, and uh, July are, are are pretty pretty potent. Now, this one is actually my 2009 bottle, um, December of 2009, which this one it's kind of really it's hard to see here. Yeah, I can't really let me see once. That one's nine zero o two. So that's my deep, that's my December. Now that one is the original fragrance. Uh, that, 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 I'm sorry, that's the original, um, you know, silver collar, um, you know, for the sprayer and everything. That's that's the actual original formulation. Now that one is a beast. I've heard. Um, I did get a sample of the 2011 uh, April 2011, which was really really strong as well. And then I ended up purchasing a couple boxes of the the 2000 uh, the July 2011. And my nose is probably not that is is not as great as your guys is out there. Um, I really can't tell a huge difference. I know that um, the 2011 in April and the July, I mean, I, I believe is basically the same for me. I mean, I, one might be a tad bit stronger. I'm not not too sure, but all I know is it, it smells great. I've gotten more compliments on this cologne. I know this is a nighttime winter cologne. Um, you know, club clone, things like that. But, I, you know, I wear it to work, and uh, and girls love it. I, I get a lot of compliments, even, even uh, from guys and everything. So it's just a just a really good fragrance. But um, your top notes is going to be lavender. Middle notes is pear and iris. And your base notes is going to be vetiver and Virginia cedar. Now, correct me if I'm wrong on some of those. Uh, like I said, this is my first re review, so go easy on me. But uh, so there's your box. Um, I think the boxes have always been the same as well. So it came out in 2007. Um, there's your bottle, which is very, very classy. I love this bottle. Um, and then, of course, you're, you're matching all your serial numbers and everything. 1U02 is right there. This is the 3.4 ounce. Um, I'll take the cap off real quick so you guys can see the, the collar. Now, of course, this one has the black collar. Where um, and it says you know Dior, Dior Homme, and then you have the CD up there. Now the 09, that will have the silver collar. So this this part will basically be silver. That's going to be your original original formulation. So, and again, you guys can you know correct me if I'm wrong on a lot of the on the formulations and everything. I, all I know is. I've heard a lot of people even say that even the new 2012, you know, that the brand new bottles of it are are still really, really good. I mean, the you know, the, the scents are just awesome. Um, the the top of it is kind of a, it's kind of deceiving. I mean, it's it's you get that real like lipstick vibe and kind of makeup clay, you know. But I I, I enjoy that 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 you know the scent. But um, after a half an hour of wearing it, it's just amazing what it'll um, what it'll do. It it gives you this just cocoa kind of vanilla I mean it's just it's really hard to explain but just what an awesome uh what an awesome fragrance after the after it dries down and it lasts killer time I mean long time now I do usually 
one spray middle of my neck and then um, one on the side, one on the other side. I'm not, I'm not too much into the spraying on my wrist or anything, but a lot of times I'll be wearing like dress shirts and stuff to work. And I mean, after like three, four days, you know, when you grab your clothes out of the, out of your hamper to do the laundry, you can still smell it on there. So, I mean, it's, it, it's very, very strong and longevity is at least, I would say, um, you know, eight to 10 hours. It projects probably, you know, four to six, pretty, pretty heavy. So um, just an awesome fragrance. DHI, I mean, just awesome. Uh, I, I really do love it. Um, so I just wanted to kind of go over some of that with you. And uh, again, there's the bottle. And um, like I said, you guys have so many awesome reviews on this, but I'm really getting into it, and I, I just love it. I love watching all the reviews on YouTube, and I'm kind of proud of my collection now a little bit. Uh, I got a lot of nice creeds. Um, I'll go over some of that collection with you too, but I also do have a, a some uh, some videos on my collection, uh, you know, out there right now, so you can kind of take a look at some of that stuff. But again, I'm not an expert in reviews. I just kind of wanted to wanted to wanted to kind of share with you just my experiences too with uh, some of the clones I've gotten because um, it's just awesome getting so many compliments, and you guys really know your stuff out there on on YouTube. So, thanks for watching, and uh, I'd appreciate some comments, and I'll talk to you soon.